Triple Threat Match for the WWF Championship. Triple H defends against the Rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin. Vince McMahon is the guest referee. And remember, nothing would make Vince happier than seeing Triple H lose the title. That does it for Metal. For Tom Pritchard, I'm Kevin Kelly. We'll see you this Sunday in Survivor Series. Next, at home with Rena Mero and the risk she's taking on national TV. This could either make or break my career. Bad girl way. Now she's doing a Martha Stewart. My famous tomato sauce. Ahead, forget Playboy. Extra exposes the real Rena Mero and her next step to get your attention. Ow! Hulk Hogan says some people in the WCW want to end his career just because he's 46. Trying to force me into an early retirement. Is the Hulkster fighting age discrimination? Don't miss the interview that could rock the wrestling world. They're in for a, a pretty good brawl here. Hulk's last stand. Next extra. The wrestler, formerly known as Sable, fought her own battle with the WWF over sexual harassment. Although it cost her that famous name, <laughs> Rena Mero is bouncing back. And Sable fans might be surprised by her life beyond the ring. Scott Rappaport spent time with Rena at home in this extra exclusive. Are you boys ready for the grind? As the eye-popping bombshell of the WWF, Sable was called a lot of things. Sexy, sassy, flashy, trashy. I would have to say yes to all those things. But here are some words you might never have thought of. Mother. So how you like me now? <laughs> Wife. Cook. My famous tomato sauce. Meet the sable you never got to see. Rena Miro, the woman behind the vinyl, behind the hot pants, and behind those annoying little banners that keep blocking our view. I think I'm getting hustled. We spent the day with Rena at her five-acre spread outside Orlando, Florida, complete with pool and tennis court, to talk about her new life after wrestling, a life she's grown very fond of. Sable was a great character to play and I really enjoyed it had fun with it but um, you know I really don't miss it life arena now is decidedly down home there's horseback riding in her spare time which she loves and working out which she doesn't and you do what you have to do and when it comes to work she does running a personal website that generates thousands of hits a day autographing the hundreds of photo requests she receives and fielding offers for TV commercials like this one for the ad pad Hi, I'm Rena Mero. She's taking acting lessons several times a week, preparing for her first role in the action thriller Doppelganger 224, which starts filming in January. The ultimate goal is pursuing my acting career. Still, her number one priority is her husband, former wrestler Mark Miro, who she once fought in a wrestling match. They've since made up. We're virtually inseparable, and we like it that way. And the other love of her life. Her 11-year-old daughter, Mariah, whom she likes to pal around with in the pool. And Mariah let us in on a little secret. Seems her mom's not only been taking acting lessons, she's taking singing lessons. Curious? This could either make or break my career, so I'm not going to do it right now. I'm not letting you off the hook. To feel the way I feel. And hey, if the singing thing doesn't work out, with all the other stuff going on in her life, Rena Miro will still be sitting pretty. Sitting pretty is right. In fact, Rena is only one of a handful of women to grace the cover of Playboy magazine twice in one year.